I want to wish everybody a Merry Christmas, Happy New Year. Thanks for your support of the Invitator. Uh, I know we had a little issue last year, but that's all fixed and done, and we're back rolling. I wanted to read a couple of uh, testimonies. Uh, that are, I, usually, I get an email, I'll take a picture of it. I don't always, but I've got a picture of two or three here I wanted to share with you just to let you know it really does work. If I can, there's one that doesn't have a name, at least not in my picture. I've hunted with many motion decoys and all seem to work pretty decently, but the imitator is by far my favorite. This past week I help out with veteran hunts and man, I put your rig to the test and it paid off. Over the week we killed 117 birds off of your decoy and several happy hunters. Great product. Good testimony. Here's another one. Uh, a guy named Noah. I love it, man. I'm only 19 years old and just now getting into duck hunting. The imitator brought my spread to life. The ripples it makes after it pops back up bounces off the other decoys, which makes them look like they have some action, too. I'll send some photos when I get on some ducks. I've been visiting my family in South Texas and went there to see how it was. And we only got a couple. So another guy likes it. There's another one that's my favorite. It's a little long. I can find it right quick. Yeah, here it is. Ted, I've got to be honest and say that I was skeptical how well the units would work. I've got to close or got close to 40 years of duck hunting and have seen a lot of things come around. So far, I have used your imitator both in the rice fields in China, Texas, and in the local marsh in southeast Texas. I've also managed to break a few strings, replace numerous fuses, and repair several wires, all due to operator error or whatever, it doesn't matter. Nevertheless, the imitator actually works extremely well and probably even better than extremely well. I've witnessed both puddle ducks, divers respond in a manner that I've only seen replicated in Saskatchewan, Canada, when the ducks are just beginning to migrate. One of the many surprising events is how well it makes the ducks feel comfortable. They actually land both inside and outside the decoy, swimming over to the imitators and begin feeding. They respond so well, it isn't necessary to even hit the call. Another astounding fact, especially while hunting public land, is that it's only necessary to hit the call once to make them look, and the imitator actually pulls them away from other decoy spreads. The past week, I was able to hunt several days on public land at J.D. Murphy's in Port Acres. Many, and if most, of the hunting parties scored a zero, while my experiences, experience was completely different. Both biologists and game warden questioned what I was doing different. I just want to congratulate you and say that you have an excellent product. He goes on to say a few things. Great testimonies. It really does work, and it will finish the duck. So Merry Christmas, Happy New Year. Don't forget this next year. I always try to push this because that's the name of the company. Share one another's burden, so hunting company. Help somebody this year. Make it a habit to help somebody. Maybe an elderly person that can't uh, afford someone to come by and mow the yard and pay them a hundred bucks every two or three weeks. Find an elderly person that's a fixed income, Social Security, and try to help them out. Anyway, good luck this year, rest of the year hunting. December's nearly over. Some people's season's almost closed already. We go to the end of January, so good luck, and thanks, guys.